And so there it is. There's everything. If you wanted to see the Vigilant Christian exposed, there he is. Disgusting, eh? I know. I know. <laughs> the God is a God of grace and mercy. This weekend, I'm five days sober, praise God. I'm so broken. <laughs> oh. So this weekend, I went to a men's conference. The Holy Spirit spoke to me and said, Mario, and he did an altar call after for men who wanted to recommit themselves to the Lord. And I went up weeping with tears. And the Lord spoke to me and said, by his spirit in my heart, Mario, you're going to get another chance to do this because I am a merciful God. I don't care about your sin. I have died for it. I'm a God of mercy and grace and you're my son and I love you. But I need you to commit to sobriety. Not only me, but being sober. Sobriety has to be the most important thing in your life moving forward with me. The Bible, by the way, Jericho is where the walls fell down. And these are walls in my life I haven't been able to tear down. And I think now through this, God is finally going to tear down my walls. <laughs> And allow me into the promised land. I've been wandering in the desert and I need those Jericho walls to fall. And I'm going to Jericho Road. <laughs> and I still was caught in that filth. There is no greater sinner than that. I believe that's worse than murder. I know Jesus. <laughs> so if God can have mercy and grace on me, he can have mercy on you. Oh, trust me, he can. And I, I, I'm excited. Because this is gross. This is sick. This isn't me. If you're stuck being who deep down you know you're not, please seek God and get help. And I don't know why I do it. I'm stupid. I know there's no fulfillment in those things. But yet, I like a stupid dog going to eat its vomit, I go back to it. <laughs>